Hello everyone, so I thought I'd do something a little bit different today. This video was actually suggested by one of my viewers and that is to do a piano tutorial on how I played the theme to Call the Midwife. I absolutely love Call the Midwife, it's one of my favourite programmes, um, it's just so cosy, I love it. So I've actually never done a piano tutorial before, so let's get started. Okay. So first I'm going to be teaching you the right hand, then I'll teach you the left hand and then we'll bring them together slowly. So, in the right hand you want to start on C and then we're going to go to A flat, B flat. So again, C, A flat, B flat. And the next bit is A flat, B flat, C, like so. So I'll try that bit again. C, A flat, B flat, A flat, B flat, C. So that second time you want to be doing it a little bit quicker. So, bum bum bum, then A flat, B flat, then the next bit after that we go to A flat, G, A flat, I'll go back to C, then B flat, do it again. A flat, G, A flat, C, B flat. Okay, so now I'm going to bring those two sections together. playing these uh, notes. Now obviously this piece of music was written for string instruments, so the cello and the violin, so really think about sustaining those notes when you play them. Now the next bit, we go C, D flat, E flat, and back down, D flat, C. Again, C, D flat, E flat, D flat, C. So when we're coming back down, we want to be going slower than when we go back up. So da 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 da. So as you can see, really sustain those notes as if you were playing it on a violin. The next part is. B flat to A flat very quickly. Da, 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 da. Now I'm going to bring those sections together. So C, A flat, B flat, da, da, C, A flat, B flat, A flat, G, A flat. C, B flat, C, D flat, E, D flat, C, B flat, A flat. So the next part we start on C and then we go to B flat, A flat, G, F. But with these three notes, I play them a little bit faster. C, B flat, da, da. So now we're going to bring the whole of the right hand together. Now in my original video I actually played this an octave higher, 
but for this video I'm just going to be playing them close together so it's easier to see your hands and where you're going to be moving about. Once you've got the gist of it you can move it up, you can add the pedals in and you know we can just we can play around with it. So here is the whole of the right hand put together very slowly. Okay, so for the left hand, we are going to have our little finger, 5 on F, our first finger on C, and our middle finger on A flat. So we're going to go 5, 1, 3, 1. Five, one, three, one, and you play it. You play that twice. So you know. So we do it. Five, one, three, one. Five, one, three, one. Then all we're going to do is we're going to move our thumb, our thumb up to D, and now we are playing F, D, B flat, D. Five, one, two, one, five, one, two, one. So we put those two bits together. Five, one, three, one, five, one, three, one, five, one, two, one, five, one, two, one. And we then just go back to the first one and play it again. So just like this, we're going to speed it up a little bit now. And again. So now after that, we are simply moving our thumb from D to D flat. And we're going to be playing F, D flat, B flat, D flat. Every uh, broken chord that you play, you play twice. So after that, we then move our little finger from F up to G, and our, f uh, our thumb from D flat to E flat. So we're going to put all those bits together, don't worry, it'll take some time. So, starting on F, C and A flat. Move our thumb up so we can now have... And then we repeat it again. finger to G so now we are moving our fifth finger onto A flat our thumb on E flat and our middle finger on C
and then we're going to move back down to the original chord of F, C, A flat, C, F, C, A flat, C. And then again, we're going to be moving up. So our thumb is now on D flat, second finger on B flat, and our little finger on F. Then moving up again from F to G, from D flat to E flat, and our second finger is still on that B flat. And then to finish, back down to F, C and A flat. To finish. So let's bring all of that left hand together. I'm just going to do it very slowly. So here we go. Okay, so we're going to bring both of our hands together and how I'm going to do this is every time I say change, you're going to change onto the next chord. So we're going to play it really slowly. So here we go. there we go. So I hope this video helped. Um, of course you can play around with the dynamics, adding your pedal, uh, you can move it up to you know here if you want to. Um, so yeah, hope it helped and leave a comment down in the description of any uh, piano covers or tutorials you would like me to do. And I shall see you all very soon. Bye.